Swole Benji here. Today I wanted to show off a possible mob grinding like area. It is in Cutlass Keys, which is the bottom left of the map, and it is like south of the town, obviously. It's called Rubble Shores. Now here's the thing with Rubble Shores. You actually have to approach from this road, and this is a bridge. You can enter it from the bottom, but it's kind of annoying. So let me just show you. Hopefully I don't my character doesn't vault off the side. But uh, yeah, you, you can actually start it from the bottom, but I'm starting it from the top. I'm a level 42 character with level 40 gear. I have it fully gemmed with lucky pearls for more drop rates. And my stats are constitution to be very tanky, focused for better healing. I'm using a great axe and a healing staff. And the way my build works essentially is uh, on the great axe, I will be using heavy attacks so that I can't be interrupted. And... I'm going to be using Gravity Wells, so it gives me 20% Fortify. I get another 20% while using Heavy Attack, so that's 40%. I'll unlock this, hopefully during the video, get another 10% right there. And then, with the Life Staff, uh, this will give me another 15%. So, 65% damage reduction in full Heavy Armor, level 40, against level 31 mobs. I think we'll be alright. So, the goal is to just aggro as many mobs as we think we can take. And uh, yeah, we're just gonna fight them all at once. Now, these do have archers, which we don't wanna fight archers, really. But I do wanna fight a lot of mobs all stacked up on top. And I just sit there in my healing bubble and cleave them down and collect the loot and maybe possibly really good weapon experience. I don't know. But see, they don't really hurt me that much. Like, <laughs> I'm already fully healed again. <laughs> So we got, a, we got a good amount of monsters here. I would say this is a pretty fair amount. And self-cast, self-cast, cast this on the ground. They've already knocked me out of my circle. Let's start cleaving. We're just doing heavy attacks. Look at our health. I didn't even use gravity well. And there we go. We have uh, earned a 129 experience. We got a drop. What do we get? Ooh, we got a blue. Very nice. I mean, that rarity might be helping. I almost fell off. Holy crap, don't knock- Oh, the skeleton kicked me off! Oh no. Uh-oh. See, this is a- uh, That's okay, we're a heal tank. We're fine. Just doink every enemy here with a little healy ball, which hurts them, obviously. Let's see how many we can, like, kite around a little corner, right? There we go. We're fully buffed. Get the gravity well. We're fully buffed. They can't hurt us. Look at our HP. It's it's just full HP. And they're knocking me down again. They can't inter- oh, Okay, maybe that can interrupt me. There's another blue. I'm just finding blue items all the time. Like, blues are rares. Okay, switch back to heals. Let's drop another healing circle. They're knocking me out of it. Yo, archers. Chill. <laughs> I don't have a, a lot of weapon mastery and axes either, but yeah, we're just killing mobs. This is some mob grinding right here. What do we get? This is a, another blue. Very cool. What level is this? Uh, this is item scores 364, level 29 gear. Fair, this is really good stuff. This is better than faction loot. Like, this is better than what you can generally craft at that level. I wanted to go back up. Did I hit the, I hit the bottom floor, didn't I? Yeah. Excuse me. Wake up. <laughs> There's an intruder in your dungeon. And then, uh, yeah, we can just swip around the corner Athene style. Hit some buffs. And we're ready to rock and roll. I'm fully buffed. <laughs> like, they can't even hurt me. They can't interrupt me. And this this build is so, so easy. It's so brain dead, dude. Just do the heavy attacks. Just do heavy attacks, they can't do nothing. And then when they're about to die, just do a light attack, it's fine. So, so far, so good. Uh, th there's a boss at the top of the tower. Let's go fight him. He He's gonna throw javelins and stuff at us. And uh, <laughs> by the time we reach the top, maybe we can jump off and then start at the bottom and run our way back up again. I don't know, but this is some pretty cool mob grinding, I think. It might, I don't know if it's a, a good experience per hour. I heard mob grinding was heavily, heavily nerfed. Yo, let's pull some mobs outside. There's usually dudes out here like, what are you doing, man? Come on in. Yep.
This guy should aggro us just by touching him. And, you know, you, you feel like, at least this is how I feel when I'm playing. I feel like when I have my healing staff out that I'm, like, in huge danger, that I'm super vulnerable. But, you know, the honest truth is, is that I'm pretty darn tanky, uh, you know, because of the armor and stuff. Are they not going to follow? Or, I mean, they're crawlers, so, like, I don't know if they can. Okay, this looks like a fun little fight. Come on. I don't want to get near the edge, though. They'll kick me off. And where's the... Yeah, here they come. All right. And then we gravity well. I want to yoink him in here with us, but I don't have the reach yet. Unlocked. Look <laughs> our HP. Completely full. Completely full health. <laughs> it's too easy. I mean, yes, I do outlevel them, okay? I do outlevel them. So maybe I'll try higher level mobs next video or something, okay? So light attack into heavy two kind of works. We're getting... We got some strong health potion there. Very cool. And uh, we, sh we should be getting rarer things from chests, too. Uh, obviously, we didn't get anything good there, but... Yeah. Uh, easy build, easy life. Just boink them, doink them. How many we got now? That's like, what, three, four... Oh, another chest room. All right. It's time for action. Don't kick me off the side, though. Grab them all in. The gravity well says it does good damage, but it, it doesn't really, like... Okay, we've cleaved them all down. Nice and good. Now we can loot the provisions. Look at that. Some juicy... That's a big watermelon. Oh, that's two watermelons. No, oh, no rares. Okay, boss room time. Guess we'll 1v1 the boss here. I'm so glad the boss just lets me buff up, you know? He's such a nice dude. And uh, have fun blocking heavy attacks. <laughs> I mean, look, he can't stop me, dude. He, I'm doing a light attack into a heavy swing, heavy 2, because it hits twice. And I, I could actually like uh, use other abilities, like I could charge him. See, if I do a light attack, he just blocks it. Got a strong health potion, all right. He, he did, like, no damage, man. When I use my gun build, I struggle on this tower. They they hit hard. They hit really hard. All right, so we, we did do a video where... Oh, there's chests on the ledge. Why? Why would you put a chest there? All right, I'll get you. <laughs> Can I jump in the water? Will I drown? There's a chest down there, too. Let's let's walk backwards off the cliff so we don't go like overboard. Oh yeah, that's right. Okay, cool. So now we can just like start at the bottom of the tower. Did I get this one? I almost missed that. Yeah, I got that one already. Now we can just jump down here. Like we don't have to worry about damage. We we're we're a healer. <laughs> but yeah, you see that second attack? It hits twice. And uh, there's two numbers because half of that is focus damage, which is nature damage, and the other half is physical. Yeah, there's a lot of dudes down here. Let's go. Oh no, my HP. Good thing I'm a healer. And then we just kind of chill in the two circles here and uh, let's heal. Even buff ourselves. Don't even need to chug potion. Yeah, I think, I think, like, this build is simple, man. It's easy. But then again, like I said, they're kind of high level. Or, they're, I'm high level. <laughs> I outleveled them by 11. <laughs> but, uh, honestly, you you bring another build in here, you'll be squishy as heck. It, it ain't like, it ain't this easy most of the time. Yo, I want, I want as many as I can get on me. I don't like the archers knocking me around with their power shots, though. All right, let's go. Buff up. Time to buff. All right. Now we just start swinging. I would like back in my healing circle, please. 96 experience gain. There's a blue on the ground. I see it. 
these archers hurt so bad. I'm I'm actually dying. Chuck a potion. Chuck a potion. There we go. Switch to heals. Cast heals on self. I got one more heal coming. Uh, look at him knock me out of it. Little rude dudes. Alright, we're alright. We're healing. I don't have any life leech uh, passives on the axe yet. That would really help. <laughs> Anyone else would have been dead from this. But we are super tanky. Like, I'm just standing in the doorway taking taking shots. So let's get some cover. <laughs> Fortify. And uh, down they go. Alright, we got a blue and a green. Uh, okay, blue, what, what are you? Vial of Suspended Azoth. Oh yeah, that's super valuable. That is a really good drop, dude. Yeah, but yeah, th this is a winner build. This is an absolute winner build. No, I, I use self cast. I, I held, I held alt. It's supposed to cast on myself. I guess I need to just not use self cast and just aim at the ground and cast like that. I'm only getting one of the heals. All right, so mob should be respawning. <laughs> Let's go run back up the tower. One, one more trip up the old tower. Hello, Archer bro. Oh, he hit me with the bow. What a... He's like, hey, stop hitting me with healing magic. That hurts. I heard a rumor that if they're glowing blue like this, that they drop Azoth when you kill them. So I'm actually going to just kill this one, along with his two buds. And uh, we're going to see what happens. Yo, yoink him into the circle. Welcome to the, to the fighting arena. Let's see if he drops Azoth when I kill him. Oh, he's running. I heard the ding. Did you hear the ding? That little cling noise? That means it was Azoth. Maybe not. I don't know, man. I don't know what I'm talking about. Little crawly boys. I already looted that. They do hurt, though. <laughs> do 100. And I'm full tank. And I outlevel them. So imagine coming here at level 30. You get, get beat up by these, like, look at these little skeleton swordsmen. Yeah, I'm just gonna stand in your, in your attack, that's fine. Fortified. Like, calcium. We are just... <laughs> you have to actually aim down at these dudes, they're too short. We're just squishing, old man. We're the, the skeleton squisher. Yeah, yeah. So, are you having fun watching this? Watching me grind out skeleton mobs? Uh, I mean, this is the combat system. It's it's a little basic, but hey, it's it's fun, man. It's a, way more fun than all. It's basically Dark Souls the MMORPG, man. <laughs> and yeah, I know you get some more spells in Dark Souls and stuff, but still, like you don't need them. You don't like you don't end up using all those spells. You just use the main ones anyway. All right, I need to like seek. The corner here because of the archers. Yoink them together. I gotta aim down at the, the little crawly boys. Freaking running skeletons, man. Can I block this? No, I can't. Ooh, life staff leveled up. Oh yeah, that's right. As long as I tag them off with life staff. Oh, we got provisions here. Come on, rares. Let's go. Oh, we got a recipe, fruit salad. Yo, with toasted coconut. I got all of that stuff. Yo, we can learn this. We're gonna salvage it, and there we go. That. Do recipes are really, really rare. I like. I've been playing. Look, look at my playtime. <laughs> look at my playtime. Five days, ten hours, and I've been looting chests like crazy. I found two recipes. That's it. That is. Can I knock them off the side? That would be so cool if I could knock them off the edge. I don't even need to like cast healing spells. Let me do my heavy attack follow up. There we go. I did get this one already, right? Yeah. That boss should be respawned. 
Yeah, uh... <laughs> is there a food buff that I can eat to increase rarity drops from monsters and chests? Because I could tack that onto my build, and I can go, like, farm some big area with lots and lots of mob. I don't know. I want to make sure I hit them all with the life staff once, but I guess it, when I'm healing myself, that it counts anyway, right? Okay, they interrupted my spell, so I don't have that ability. Alright, now we start cleaving. Just start swinging. <laughs> cool. Uh, ancient cloth pants. Feeling a little slippery. Alright, boss room. Boss time. Boss time. Don't mind me, boss man. It's like uh, when uh, Ains Algone buffs up before the Shaltir fight. Alright, let's begin. <laughs> and we're just gonna cleave. Can't interrupt me. Oh, okay, I guess he can with the shield smite. How about we spam light attacks, just to show you the, the difference. See, now he can start blocking. Whoa, what is his biggest attack? 200, that's it? Like, I, I can outheal his damage. Like, this boss is trivialized. I could just kill him with magic. I don't even need to, like... <laughs> hey, let me get back in the circle. These guys like to knock me out of the circle. Woo! Wind up. Oh, I missed. Yo, we're a, we're a, we're a wizard and a warrior. I only hit it for 300. That doesn't feel very strong. The camera gets a little wonky when you're on walls. Alright, back to the axe. Getting that gravity well. Look how much damage that does. Not very much. Okay, heavy attack so he can't interrupt me. Bonk. Bonk. And dead. So yeah, that's the that's the it's like a healing great axe build, very cool. Now we can uh, just oh, there's a chest over here, dude. There's a chest over here. Holy crap! Ooh, it's got like bread in it. I didn't get I got cheese and onions. <laughs> oh, it's the small things. Oh, I can charge off the side of this. Um, I think I will. Let's see if the fall damage kills me. There's gators down there. Yo, let's get them gators. Oh, only half my health. That's fine. You just cast this, and you cast this, and then you just chill for like a couple seconds. Yeah. Uh, there we go. Didn't quite fully get healed, but hey, that's over 3,000 HP, and uh, I landed in a chest. I didn't plan this. I, uh, I'm just playing organically, like... Whoa, there's a, is there a person? Or... There's a person. I haven't seen a person here before. This is weird. I don't know what to do. <laughs> Social. Uh... Oh, there's a chest there too. Oh, and there's, well, there's one down here. All right, just grabbing all the chests. More onions. Dude, these skeletons like their onions. These are the onion bros. Tell you. I'm telling you, man. All right, Mr. Scout, don't knock me off while I steal your loot. Oh, he doesn't even see me. So here's the cool thing, like, you can just kind of get close to him while you're crouching. Dude, I'm a sneaky boy. Whoa! <laughs> I jumped off. It's okay. No, I wanted to see if I could fight... There was some gators down here. Or at least a gator. I mean, it's only level 30. I want more than one gator, though. I want, like, five gators. And then we'll end the... Oh, we got skelly bros and gators. It's, uh... They're teaming up, man. They're sick of my presence here. Alright. Let's go. Gravity well. Get the full tank action. There we go. Oh, he tail whipped me. Ow. Jerk. <laughs> no, I gotta do my heavy attacks or he'll knock me down every time. Yeah. Oh, what? Can I, can I flip up? When I'm lightweight, I can flip up faster. Maybe that's the trick to killing heavy armored people, is just use knockdown abilities. Alright, let's give you a skin. Well, that's the video, guys. That's just some mob grinding with this axe build. Pretty cool stuff, I think. It's a lot of fun, too. Um, you know, because it's got the sustained heals. How much armor damage did we take? Our durability is 568 out of 625. 
Uh, and it, like, to repair this would cost one coin and two repair parts out of 800. Yeah, that, this, this build, <laughs> dude. Uh, we were getting beat up hardcore, and we're, we're taking, like, no durability damage. So, yeah, that's, that's the video, guys. I'm Soul Benji. Thanks for watching. As always, be a bro and stay swole. Leave a like and a comment. If you do both, it is a YouTube combo. It's like an algorithm cheat code. It really helps out. Also, subscribe. 72% of you aren't subscribed. We're stuck on that number, I swear. Um, <laughs> so, go ahead and subscribe. I know that the algorithm shows you my videos. It's completely free to subscribe. You can always unsubscribe later if you feel like it. Uh, take care, lads. I will see you in the next one. Hope you enjoyed.